Hey everyone, welcome to my new tutorial. In this tutorial, I'm gonna show how to make this like animation with After Effects. Let's get started. So first step, let's create new background. Right mouse, new and solid. Add name background and select color. Like this, color code F7, F7 and F7. Click OK and again click OK. Lock layer and select this like illustrator file. Move to inside this composition. OK and hide layer. Then go to shape, select ellipse tool and hold shift, make one circle. Click selection tool, OK, and hold control, click this palm behind, move to anchor point to center, click selection tool again, and change name, circle, OK, then control D, and go to fill, change color, light blue, click OK, and right mouse precoms add name reflection click ok and open this reflection composition select this circle to ctrl d for duplicate and select this circle to change non to alpha inverted matte if you not see here click toggle switch modes and change non to alpha inverted matte circle 3 then move to here okay nice okay back to light composition and select this reflection move to here press s change scale 95 and move to here okay not bad then select this circle again ctrl d for duplicate and right mouse precoms change name shadow click ok and open shadow composition select this circle go to fill and change color dark blue click ok and select this circle to again control default duplicate select this circle to change alpha inverted mat to circle 3 and move to here like this back to like composition okay and press s change scale 9 to 5 move to here okay nice not bad let's change scale 100 and move to here this Okay, let's change scale 98. Okay, not bad. So, select this circle, shadow and reflection. Right mouse, precoms and add name, circle. Click OK. And go to animation composer, open animation composer 3. And starter pack presets folder. And open to the layer. Let's use overshot scale. Click in and close window. Let's see. Okay, move to right this tier in. Nice. Okay, select this like illustrator file. Let's unhide. Move to up and press S, change scale. Move to here. Then go to shapes, change wrenchel tool, and let's make wrenchel. Okay, click selection tool, change color white, click OK, move to right. Okay, hold control and click palm behind, move to anchor point center. 
and change name like to okay let's open shape layer contents rental one and rental part one in this time let's click this icon and create new size keyframe move to right and change size zero let's see okay select keyframes right mouse keyframe ascent easy or f9 go to graph editor select this graph move to left for smooth graph okay move to right this keyframe okay in this time let's close like to select this like illustrator file go to palm behind move to anchor point here and click selection tool go to here press air make rotation keyframe and go to back change rotation like this okay and go to here change rotation minus 8 and go to here change 4 again go to here change minus 2 and go to here change plus 1 and go to again here change 0 let's see okay select keyframes right mouse keyframe ascent easy okay select these keyframes hold alt move to left and select these keyframes move to left again let's see nice okay go to here select this like a sort of file hold shift and press s open scale and make scale keyframe move to right and change scale zero let's see and change scale 70 okay and go to here change 5 to 8 and go to here again change 62 let's see nice select keyframes right mouse and easy ease okay let's click toggle switch modes and select this like layer click this icon for motion blur and let's activate this enable motion blur for all layers let's see okay select this like to move to left and like layer move to here let's see okay not bad So thank you for watching my tutorial and don't forget to subscribe channel, like video and please follow me on Instagram. Good luck.